What's up guys? I wanted to go out into the woods and uh, flip a bunch of rocks to see if we can find anything cool. In particular, I'm looking for salamanders to avenge my failure to find one on the road trip. So, uh, let's see what we find. So the first animal that I found was actually on the way to the woods, the uh, state forest that I was heading to. And I saw him walking across the road, this nice little turtle right here. And of course when I walk up to him, he stops walking. And uh, I can't have him standing in the middle of the road. So I give him a little nudge. But he doesn't seem interested in moving, so... Eventually I realize I'm just going to have to pick him up. And uh, carry him to a safe spot. All right, well, that's a good sign that uh, there's little aquatic critters romping about. So eventually I made it out to the state forest where I was gonna go looking for all sorts of critters. And uh, I went to this very low lying area that was extremely damp. It was covered in this moss that didn't really have any roots. So if you pulled on it, it just kind of came out uh, without any effort. So I started flipping logs, and for a little while all I found were earthworms. There were millions of them, but eventually I found a salamander, and I was totally ecstatic because I hadn't seen one of these guys in years. So I've just found a couple of these uh, totally black ones, blackish gray, but eventually I found this one, uh, which has reddish orange on the back, which is pretty sick. And one thing that I discovered about these little guys is if they know that they're being held by someone and they don't necessarily like it, they'll jump. But don't worry, uh, I don't think they take fall damage because they're so small, you know, it's like a, like a bug falling or something. And speaking of bugs, I found a queen carpenter ant in one of those little logs that I was flipping. And uh, this is a unrelated carpenter ant colony and so one of those logs and uh, yeah I kept finding tons of salamanders which was awesome so obviously this is a good spot for them and this guy just decided that he wants to hang out in my pouch so I went in my pouch and looked for him to try to take him out but uh, yeah I never found him Here's another couple big guys that I found. This is probably the biggest specimen of the uh, one with the red back that I had found during that time. I was only out there for probably about an hour and a half in total. And here's the biggest all blackish gray one that I found. And right here, this is pretty sick. It's an all purple mushroom, which I, I've never seen anything like that before. And it was growing right at the base of this dried out kind of Indian pipe type plant so I don't know if they have some sort of symbiotic relationship. Right here we have a termite colony living right next to some sort of ant colony which is interesting to see. And then a giant strange bug that I, I've never seen anything like it before living with the two colonies. I ended up collecting two carpenter ant queens and I may keep them, I may release them, because that type of queen, you have to hibernate them over the winter, and I don't really know if I want to deal with that. Here are some penis mushrooms, aka stinkhorn fungus, that I found at my dad's. Here are some caterpillars that were outside of his house as well. And uh, if you want to know where I get my interest in bugs, it's from him. He actually takes care of the caterpillars and get, buys them herbs to eat and releases them when they're butterflies. Here is a very hairy caterpillar that I found. And I'm sure this is the kind where if you touch it, it'll burn and itch like hell. Uh, so I definitely didn't touch it. Here's a little garden variety frog that I found just chilling in a puddle. 
and uh, I'm assuming one of its predators. <clears throat> this big old bird. I'm not sure what type, some sort of crane, maybe? And finally, my friend Evan actually spotted this praying mantis, and I'll just let him say what we're all thinking. This guy's so rare, too. This is a good find. Mm-hmm.